we were closed due to the Hurricane Ida back on September 1st. We had to shut down for five months to completely renovate and rebuild. The whole store was completely wiped out. So we had to replace the floors, the walls, the equipment, the cabinets, everything from scratch. The community was fantastic. Um, when we would post on Facebook, a lot of people, customers we knew, customers we didn't know, would actually offer to come in and help and do everything from demo to bring a generator to just come and clean up. Um, and they would check in with us quite often. Are you open yet? Are you guys doing okay? Um, so we had a lot of support from the community and we were looking forward to reopening and being back here. Everything needed to be replaced. All of the equipment in the studio, the treads had been underwater. Everything was ruined, So, and all the way up the walls. So we had to go six feet up to get all of the damage, rip everything out, and replace everything new. Floors from the walls down to the floors. All of the equipment needed to be replaced, everything. So we started from scratch. The members we love, our member base, has been amazing. We had a GoFundMe page, they contributed as much as they could and far more than we expected, um, both for the staff and for the studio. The other communities, um, or the other businesses in the community came out. Um, we were helping one another out. We were at North Shore, North Shore was here, Duck Donuts was here. We were using all of the same um, equipment to help clean up next door. It was, everybody really pitched in. Um, everybody felt it and everybody wanted to help. The members uh, missed the workouts. They wanted to uh, maintain the sense of community and of course they wanted to maintain their health during this time. So we had outdoor workouts um, during in the parking lot for a while. I think that was during um, before, but during this time we held them in Harbor Island Park. We have an awesome member base. Uh, many of them kept going to other studios during that time. They want to keep up with their fitness routine. So by the time we opened, they were very excited, very supportive, which was really nice um, that they had just kind of stuck through everything with us. So it was just a very exciting time, you know, just for them to get back, get in the routines, feel good. And it was really appreciated a lot that they were very supportive of everything. There's a lot more growth potential here. Uh, we have an amazing staff. We have amazing coaches. I'm just, I can't wait. I mean, I, I know the classes are just going to start busting at the seams. Despite all of the obstacles and all of the challenges that happen, um, we're here. We're still here. We're better than we were before. And while it doesn't always feel that way, um, I think it's important not to give up, just to keep moving. And even though progress can be slow and there will be setback after setback, if you keep moving, you will achieve what it is that you want. <laughs>